Beretta is uh, kind of an up-and-comer in the shotgun market, right? You guys have made a couple of these? Yeah, a couple of them. Once, once or twice? Yeah, okay. we've been around for years. <laughs>Clay Martin here with Guns America SHOT Show 2017. Now we're down at the Beretta booth talking with Christopher. Hi, Christopher. Yeah. About shotguns. And uh, Beretta is uh, kind of an up-and-comer in the shotgun market. Right? You guys have made a couple of these? Yeah, a couple of them. Once, once or twice? Yeah, okay. been around for years. <laughs> Since at least the early 90s or 1490s, something close okay. to that. Okay. So, uh, so what are we looking at? What's the new shotgun from Beretta this year? So we've got three new ones. Uh, we have an A400 Lite 20 gauge in Max 5 camo. This one right here. So basically it's a... 20 gauge waterfowl shotgun. Uh, comes with kickoff plus for a 50% recoil reduction even on 20 gauge. Shoots really, really soft. One of the great features about this is the scaled receiver so it can fit you know people of all shapes and sizes. Mm -hmm. And it's really basically 20 gauge ammunition has come a long way, especially in waterfowl hunting. So you know people that are recoil sensitive to those big 12 gauge loads, you know we now have an option for them. Very nice. That is a nice light shotgun. I like it. One of the great things about it too is it has uh, stock spacers down here, so you can they can lengthen and reduce the length of okay. poles. Okay, makes so for a great a a youth short, shotgun, something like that. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. Nice. Very cool. Very cool. So this is a 400 light. What's MSRP on this? MSRP is 1700. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. So What's the next one is the A400 XL Sporting Black. Ooh. So this is the Sporting Clays, uh, basically, uh, top semi-auto right here. That's a good looking uh, shotgun. It is really nice. So uh, it comes with a carbon fiber rib. It's got great steelium barrels that have a matte finish to help reduce glare, especially if you're shooting into the sun. It's got great oversized controls. And we, uh, we offered this initially with a blue receiver, but based on a lot of customer feedback, mm -hmm. they really like the black. This really kind of goes into wow. uh, our strategy with the black edition shotguns that we have, ranging from the DT-11, uh -huh. the 692, and even the 690. So we're bringing this into the semi-automatic competition I, world now. I gotta tell you, I'm a sucker for uh, dark wood stocks. This is a very good looking shotgun, I like this. Yep. Also looks like you guys have really brought in like from the 1301 competitive shotgun, yep. the same kind of controls into this platform. So yep. that's, that's Oversized pretty Oversized control, yep. being able to load and uh, unload really quickly and easy is super, super important sporting plays. Very cool, very cool. Yep. What's MSRP in this? 2200. 2200, wow. The last one is the 690 Field One. Um, basically it's a updated version of the 690 uh, platform of guns. Uh, it's got great new uh, re engraving on the receiver. It's kind of a bridge between uh, modern and traditional engraving. Mm -hmm. It's got floral uh, floral design. It's got great steelium barrels. Uh, these barrels are basically the same barrels we have on our competition shotguns. Okay. It's got 65 millimeter forcing cones. That helps I, with patterning. I don't know if you should hand recoil. this one to me. I don't know if I can afford it. Oh, you can. <laughs> you can't stop that what's, what's the MSRP on this? MSRP is 29.50. That's really not bad. Okay. Not too bad. That's a lightweight 20 gauge model right there. Really quick, uh, quick feeling in the hands. Just nice upland shotgun. It's got great two and a half grade Turkish walnut on it. It's a hand oiled. Wow. Very cool. All right. Well, hey, looking good. Thanks a lot for your time. All right, thank you.